In this video, we will explain how to block third-party cookies with Google Tag Manager and Cookie Yes. Make sure you have a Cookie Yes account. Cookie Yes automatically blocks third-party cookies on your website until users give their consent. But if you are using Google Tag Manager to add third-party scripts to your website, you may want to block cookies set via Tag Manager that have not been consented to use. For this, you should create a custom event trigger in your GTM account. Here's how. First, create a user-defined variable. Click the required container name from your accounts. Select variables from your workspace. And click New here. Click Variable Configuration and from under Page Variables here, choose Variable Type as First Party Cookie. The First Party Cookie variable allows Google Tag Manager to access the first party cookies created by your website. Now, enter the name of the cookie that you want to block as the cookie name. For example, Cookie Yes Consent. Next, name the variable. For example, Analytics and save it. The next step is to create the custom event trigger that will eventually help block the cookies. Back on the workspace, select Triggers and click New to open the trigger configuration. Click on it and then choose Custom Event as the trigger type here. Enter period followed by an asterisk as the event name. Then check the Use Regex matching checkbox. Choose some custom events under this trigger fires on and set conditions for the trigger to fire. Select the variable you created earlier, which is analytics in this case, and set the condition as contains and analytics colon yes, as shown. Name the trigger and save it. The next step is to add this custom event trigger to the custom HTML tag of your service. To do that, select Tags on the workspace and click to open the tag you created. Click here under Triggering and choose the custom event trigger that you created before. Then, save the changes. Next, these changes must be submitted to make it live. Click Submit here on the top and add a name and description for the version or skip it. Then click Publish here to make the tag live on your website. Once you have done these steps, Analytics Cookies will not run in the background if users disable Analytics Cookies and enable others. This is how you block third-party cookies using Google Tag Manager and Cookie Yes. We hope you find this video useful. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment below or contact Cookie Yes support.